Rising debts, declining populations, shaky growth. We all struggle to figure out the way the world is working and are intimidated by the amount of information thrown at us. My work is to filter this down to a small set of relevant indicators, from debt and demographics to media hype and billionaire wealth. Currency crises, for example, are often blamed on foreign speculators. But what my research shows, it is the locals who provide the first warning signals of crises. Russian money fled well before the ruble crisis in 1998. The same happened in Mexico in 1994. And in 2015, more than half a trillion dollars left China, much of it taken out by local Chinese. But it's not enough to just read the data. The point is also to be on the ground. Whether the subject is money flows or politics, the locals are the first to know whether a factory is not competitive anymore or if a revolt is brewing in a nation. We live in an impermanent world. The key is to figure out what are the most important factors that will help us predict which nations will rise and which will fall.